So, what's the plan now? agency long? No, I've only just joined. This is my first date, actually. <laughs> kind of nervous. I wasn't sure what to expect. How about you? Been doing this a while. Been on a few dates. No perfect matches yet, then? Not really. Searching through all the bad eggs, I guess. These things never happen overnight, I suppose. Has she gone yet? Yeah, she left at seven. Had to go to work. Mm-hmm. Right. <laughs> so, what did you think? Not interested. Felt like another notch on a bedpost. <laughs> and that's a bad thing because... Didn't have anything in common? All right. Tell me again, why did we think Lonely Arts dating was a good idea? I can't remember. Because you've been sitting in this flat for months and you said you wanted to meet people. Right. So, what do I do now? Right, go on another date. But maybe you shouldn't sleep with anyone straight away. I mean, be a bit mysterious. <laughs> So what do you do? I can't say, I'm afraid. Oh, what is it? Like, top secret or something? It is, yes. OK. So, what are you like, a spy? Well, let's just say I work for a government agency that specialises in emergency diplomatic situations. Right. Like James Bond? I never said that. Right. Do you excuse me for a moment? And she never came back. <laughs> Sorry. OK, that's not quite what I meant by mysterious, Jeff. Look, how about next time you go on a date, you take me with you? How am I supposed to do that exactly? You're an intelligent man, Jeff. You can figure it out. I mean, it couldn't possibly go any worse than last time, could it? I don't know. I'm not going to embarrass you, am I? What, what do you take me for? I mean, you promise I can come. Go on, promise. Promise. Salad on granary, please. Is day? Not especially. You? I think if I see another sandwich, I might just turn into one. That bad? No. Just not exactly my dream career. Tree surgery. How did you guess? Two pound fifty, please. Bye.
She's really nice. Very pretty. What's her name? Alice. Oh. She's funny too. And this is the first person I've met since Charlotte that didn't involve a box number. Hmm. So, what time are we going then, you know? What do you mean, we? This isn't a blind date. I'll, I'll be fine. Jeff, if recent memory serves, haven't you been putting your foot in it? And anyway, Jeff, you promised. Remember? No, I, I kind of fell in with the wrong crowd and dropped out of college. You know, it was all a bit wild for a while and uh, I guess I'm paying for it now. Although, God, I never thought I'd be making sandwiches at my age. <laughs> well, maybe those times were worth it. You seem to be on the right track now. Yeah, I don't regret it. I just remember I was halfway through my degree and hating every second of it. Ruined my relationship. And at the time, I just didn't want my career to be more important than my life. I think my wild times passed me by. Why? What happened? I got married. Oh. I'm sorry. Well, maybe those times are worth it, too. Excuse me for a moment. What do you think? I don't know. What do you think? I like her. Right. She's smart and she sounds like maybe she's got her priorities in the right order. <laughs> she's not Charlotte, Jeff. She doesn't have to be. Well, she, she sounds flaky. She's unreliable. I like her. Don't you want me to be happy? Yeah, I think you should wait for Charlotte to come back. What do you mean? Charlotte's not coming back. She left us, remember? <sighs> I'm sorry, but I've been lonely for so long, and I really like this girl, and I don't care what you say, all right? Is she really not coming back? No. She has a new life now. I always thought she would. Alice was nice. night. I can't explain. Oh no, forget it, you don't have to. Um, should we just start afresh? Okay. Um, why don't we just go out for a drink? Sure, when? Well, what are you doing tonight? Yeah, that would be great. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I know where that is. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. I'll see you there. Okay. Bye. That was Alice.